Okay, here we have meiosis. Meiosis. Um, have a few structures here: the outer cell membrane, the cytoplasm, the uh, spindle fiber. But most of them we're going to show down here. Um, so we've got the outer cell membrane, cytoplasm, nucleus, nucleolus. Um, centrioles, which are these two things here, and these two are also centrioles. This is the aster. It's another aster. Um, chromatin threads. Um, we got to go back up here for first female, the spindle in process of formation, and the first male picture, the spindle in process of formation. Um, See, we showed the, the spindle fibril here and here, number nine. Um, back here we have number 10, the chromosome, and 11, chromatid, uh, 12, centromere. I think it's this middle thing right here. So there's not really an arrow, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. All right, now we go parts and structures unique to meiosis. So we've got the male side there and the female side there. Um, this is our primary spermatocyte, um, early metaphase of cell division. This is anaphase, or the reduction uh, division. Uh, 14, so we have A, 14, the secondary spermatocyte, and the secondary spermatocyte um, in process of equational division, which both of them do. And 15 here, they are our spermatids, and 16 uh, are our spermatozoa. Go to the female side, we have our uh, our primary oocyte. Then we have metaphase of cell division. Our secondary oocyte, which is in the in the process of forming here. Um, so that's that's 18 is our secondary spermocyte, secondary oocyte, which is forming, um, and then 19, which is our first polar body, which is forming. Uh, 20 is our ootid or ovum. Uh, 21 are our second polar bodies. Uh, one is in the process of dividing, and two are complete. So here are complete polar bodies, and the one in the process of dividing. Again, 20 is the ootid or ovum. Um, 22, we have our ovum, or ootid, still, I guess. And um, 23 is the diploid cell, zygote, result of the union of sperm and ovum. Um, and it looks like, ooh, there's more. Nope, that's it.